Hey, what's up, y'all? I'm Emil Innish Jr. back here with Clever News, and Halsey is opening up about how Mac Miller's death affected her life and how she gathered up the courage to make a major life decision. As if it hasn't already been made clear through her powerful songwriting skills, Halsey is an open book when it comes to sharing her personal experiences with fans. And I mean open book in the most literal sense as she just released an entire book of poetry called I Would Leave Me If I Could, detailing her innermost thoughts as well as the struggles that she's endured in past relationships. Just last week, many fans began assuming that one poem in particular called Lighthouse shed light on Halsey's tumultuous relationship with g Easy following their one-year relationship that ended in 2018. Although g Easy's team was quick to deny the rumors, this didn't stop fans from speculating in the slightest. But just this week, Halsey gave even more insight into her writing process and the best times to open up about your feelings during an interview on Dax Shepard's Armchair Expert podcast. Haldi admitted that writing in pain helps sort out her emotions and gives her this epiphany when she's finished writing. She said, quote, I'll tell people until I'm blue in the face, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. And then I'll get in the studio and I'll write something and listen back to it and be like, oh, I was harboring a tremendous amount of resentment about that thing. But it's not just songwriting that helps Halsey sort out her feelings. She then opened up about how Mac Miller's tragic death affected her and even helped her make a difficult decision to leave a relationship with an addict. She said, quote, this is a terrible thing to say because I think it puts a positive connotation on a heinously tragic event, but it gave me the courage and the faith to leave the relationship I was in. It gave me that real reality check that I needed and I think it probably did the same for a lot of other people too. She added, as a result, my currency of expressing love with them became doing drugs with them and she also revealed there was a lot of infidelity in the relationship too. It was like, if I don't do it with you, you're going to go do it with someone else and then probably them and I'm going to take you back anyway because this is what we do. Halsey also admitted that she was dealing with this toxic relationship while battling bipolar disorder, which led her to question what she was even in control of if she couldn't control her or her partner's emotions. She said, now I'm questioning my own perception of reality. I can't control myself. I can't control them. What can I control? Why am I even alive? What is even the point of anything? That was what the process was like. But it was when she left her ex that she was able to quote, get my own together and stabilize myself. She went on to talk about her album and her obvious feelings of anger, but more importantly, simultaneously having feelings of sympathy, which Halsey claimed is a vital component to telling that story. It's not just like, I'm selfishly angry with you because your addiction ruined my life. It's, I am sympathetic to knowing that the pain that you've caused me doesn't even compare to the pain that you are causing yourself. Since her split with whom she never specifically says who she was referring to, Halsey explained that she's been able to focus on being sober and taking medication for her bipolar disorder, which has completely changed her life. She admitted that she previously didn't use antidepressants or other medications because she feared they would interfere with my creative process. But that couldn't be further from the truth as she revealed, quote, I think I'm making some of the best stuff I've ever made right now because the dark stuff doesn't disappear. It's just easier to access at an arm's length now. It takes insane courage to know when to walk from a relationship that is no longer serving you. And we commend Halsey for being so open about her struggles and hoping that many others will be able to relate and someday generate the strength to do what's best for them as well. But to find out why fans think that Halsey dropped a major truth bomb about g Easy and her new poetry book, click right over here for another clever video. And then let us know your thoughts on Halsey's interview down here in the comment section below. I'm your host, Emil Ennis Jr. You can find me on Instagram at Emil Ennis Jr. And I'll see you soon right back here on Clever News. Bye, guys.